Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine, hello. Channel messages first. Y'all know how this goes. First and foremost, happy holidays, okay? <laughs> Even my cat got excited for some reason. She just decided to take off running, okay? Excitable, 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 you know? I'm just hearing a lot, a lot of grieving, though. I'm hearing somebody, like, just having a difficult time because of, you know, family. I'm hearing you wish somebody was here, okay? So some of you all are kind of struggling with this holiday. It's okay. It's time to make your new traditions is what I'm hearing. You know, and, and it's okay to recycle some, okay? So for instance, my grandmother, she passed in 2015, but one of the things that we used to do always as kids, you know, she raised us, so she would always have us watching The Sound of Music. So in order to honor her, like really in just, you know, excuse me, confirmation, in order to not be in a grieving moment, sad, Whatever, my sister, every year she does the annual watch of the musical, The Sound of Music. So that's how we enjoy, you know, a certain tradition without making it too heavy. Um, I'm here to remember the good times. And my condolences to anybody who's lost somebody, you know, because losing my grandmother was like losing my mom, seriously. Um, so anybody that's lost a family member, brother, sister, uncle, cousin whatever you know the moon card at the bottom the shadow self you're facing your shadow okay the sadness that you feel just my condolences you know it i'm just here you know find ways to smile okay and so that's what i have for you all today i'm gonna try to keep it a little short i am picking up a little bit of karmic energy here so somebody's mad i don't know i have no idea but we're gonna get into it a little bit okay um i'm gonna try to keep uh, these videos kind of short today so Forgive me if I'm talking pretty fast, but I'm just trying to get you the message so you can enjoy your family and be around somebody that you love today, okay? And if there's nobody around you, love on yourself, okay? You deserve this type of love. You deserve this type of, like, you know, enthusiasm. Like I said, my cat just took off running for no reason. You deserve it. So that's what I have for you for the channel messages. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas. Thank you so much for your time. Let's go to the next video for the next message, and let's get into it. Thank you. Hi, Divine Masculine. Hello, okay? Um, immediately the waiting game turns over. Let's see what's going on with you, okay? I'm just hearing that you're just kind of feeling like, you know, time to waste it. Don't you take your time, young man. Okay, let's see what's going on with you today. I'm hearing that you're not happy. You're kind of faking happiness today. Um, I'm just saying that you don't really want to be bothered, but you're kind of like, you know, I'm hearing you're doing something for the kids. Okay, so if you got kids in your environment or around you, you're kind of just, you know, trying to enjoy it, but you're faking it till you make it kind of thing. What's the situation with Divine Masculine today for Christmas? What's going on with Divine Masculine? Moving on, moving forward. I'm hearing that you definitely, definitely, this is that karmic energy that I picked up on when I was doing the channel messages, y'all. You're moving on, Divine Masculine. You don't want to be bound by this thing anymore, this person anymore, this obligation anymore is what I'm hearing, Okay. You're absolutely trying to just say, look, I'm, I'm trying to move on. I'm trying to move out is what I'm hearing too. What's your action today? Emotional loss. Yeah, you're sad. This is how you truly feel on the inside today, okay? And I'm hearing a lot of it has to do with like those childhood wounds. A lot of it has to do with children today. You know, watching them experience something so happy in such a convoluted situation, I'm just hearing it's, it's a lot of drama here when it comes down to you and your in your love life, you and your kids life, you and your inner child, okay? Lots and lots of drama here, but it's that's why you said today. What's the outcome for Divine Masculine Father? What's the outcome? Patience. Like I said, that waiting game here, your patience. So be careful when it comes down to drinking, smoking, doing anything out of the well, I won't even say out of the ordinary. Doing something to cope with life, okay? Be careful because this is all about your patience here. Being kind to yourself, gentle to yourself, because you deserve this true love with your divine feminine, and you know it. You're just trying to get yourself out of this situation, because it's a lot of drama, right? Bottom of the deck energy is deception and envy. This is that karmic energy again. Somebody's not liking the fact that you're about to move forward, move out, move on. Look, and I confirmation. You're about to move on, and they don't like that at all. Look how this person is looking. Yeah, they looking at you with the side eye for real. Again, this is giving me that possessive energy. This person doesn't want you to move on. But your ancestors, see, I grabbed the ancestor deck. I know. I know the energy. I know the vibe. Your ancestors are not going to have it. They are not going to let you be bound by this anymore. But you have to make the decision. 
magician, conjuring. This is what this person's trying to do in your life. They are absolutely trying to control some things. Instead of allowing nature to take its place and things to happen naturally, this person is possessed of. This is that manipulation here, okay? That I told you I saw here. What else do the ancestors want to say? You got to march to the beat of your own drum. You create your own tempo in life. You are the rhythm maker, okay? Then we got one more that's still on the floor here. Your ancestors are saying, use your words. Write it down. You might want to write down a poem today. Maybe you're into music, whatever the case may be. Your thoughts will be expressed more when you get them out. You can't keep that in, okay? So that's what Father's saying. You cannot keep that in because it's like keeping in all your tears, keeping in all your unhappiness. You're keeping it in and it's hurting you, okay? Emotionally, physically, it's hurting you. Give me a twin flame card today for Divine Masculine, Father. Give me a twin flame card. What's going on with Divine Masculine here? Mirrors. I wish you could see that we're mirroring each other right now. Yeah, because y'all both want to be next to each other right now, okay? And the energy and the vibe is the same. This is how you're feeling towards your Divine Feminine, okay? So that's what I have for you all today. I hope this blessed you. Let's go to Divine Feminine and see what's going on with them today, all right? Let's check in, do a quick vibe check. Thank you so much. Divine Feminine, okay? I'm just hearing that you, I mean, Divine Feminine, I'm just seeing that you're just kind of like dealing with things, all right? You're just kind of dealing with this. Whatever this is, whatever's going on with that current situation, you're like, oh my gosh. I'm hearing that you're hearing the same thing over and over and over and over and over again. So this is going to be confirmation for you, Divine Feminine, because you've been hearing this from other people. Could be other readers, could be other, um, you know, I'm even hearing preachers telling you the same thing over and over and over again about letting life happen, okay? And that's what you keep hearing. What's the situation for Divine Feminine today, Father? We got disruption. We got a tower moment here when it comes down to your life. You're letting things happen, okay? There's a lot of material and financial changes that are going on in your life, but you know your masculine is going through some tests, right? While you get blessed, your person is going through some tests. So you might be getting a lot of financial abundance right now. You're, you're getting bags, okay? I'm hearing like lots and lots of blessings. But that 555, five, five, that's because you decided to transfer out of that energy. That's transformations taking place in your life that you've allowed to the energy to, to be focused on like, you know, attracting abundance. And your masculine is at the same time going through this tower moment, this disruption. When it comes down to this karmic, okay? That's what I keep hearing. I don't know. I keep hearing it. Your action for today is the waiting game. <laughs> your action is waiting because you know your person is still dealing with a lot of tests and trials and tribulations and things that they're still going through, okay? They still haven't officially cut this off yet. They still have obligations. They still have responsibilities with this person. They're still being manipulated. Heavy, heavy, heavy on the money end too, okay? This money, somebody's like, you know holding them hostage with the finances, okay? And they they have to have the faith, okay? You gotta give it to your person. You can't make them have the faith that they need to get out of this. They need faith. They don't even need money. They don't even understand this right now, but they need faith because faith is the only thing that's gonna help them out of this, but that's their test. So again, you don't have anything to do with that, all right? Your test, you pass, you get blessed, boom. And in the meantime, you just got to wait. That's, the, that's your action, okay, for today especially. What's the outcome for Divine Feminine today, Father? What's the outcome? Oh, boy. We got suffering in silence. So you might be not getting good sleep right now. You might be having a lot of sleepless nights. You might be tossing and turning. Okay, make sure you just... <sighs> I always say this because you got to understand that some of this energy is not your energy. While your person goes through tests and you get blessed, you're like, why am I feeling like this? Why do I feel pulled? Pull? You know, why do I feel like I'm still worried about that? Well, you're not really worried about it. none of this stuff that's going on with this karmic situation. You know that that's not love. That's what Father just told me right now. You know that that's not love. So with you knowing that, none of this stuff presses you anymore, okay? It's, at this point, I'm hearing you're annoyed, all right? Like, Okay, I wish they would just go away. <laughs> Bottom of the deck energy is base chakra, so this does have to do with family life, childhood wounds, childhood trauma. Lots and lots to do with your finances. So your root chakra, your base chakra is how you, your stability, okay? And your masculine is not stable right now. You know it, so it's nothing you can really do. Your masculine is not stable. This is crumbling around them especially financially. So you can't have anything to do with that. You're getting blessed. And you're protected, but your finances are getting blessed, okay? So, let's um, 
let's get some more information here. Let's get your ancestors. What do they want to say to you today? Get an ancestor card for Divine Feminine. For Christmas. What is the answer? Singer, voice, okay? Expressing yourself. And that's so crazy because it's a channel message. I was talking about the sound of music. Expressing yourself, though. While your masculine might be writing things down, they might be typing and deleting, you need to be singing. Turn on some music. Really put yourself in a better mood, especially I'm hearing before you go to sleep because you're having problems sleeping. Something like that is tugging on you, okay? So just before you go to sleep, make sure you listen to something that's beautiful. It might even be a movie or something like that. Whatever the case may be, keep your energy in your head light, okay? Because you need that. Let's get a twin flame card to wrap this reading up for today. Twin flame cards for Divine Feminine today. And we got communication. You think I'm not listening to you, but I am. I hear everything you say, and I even replay conversations in, I, in my head. So your person is listening to you. They do want to communicate, and you know this. So it's kind of like, uh, again, this is just confirmation for you, Divine Feminine, because we've heard this before, and keep hearing it. Your person does want to speak up. They do want to talk to you, but they are in a huge test. I told you, this is the part of the test where it's the hardest. That, that part where it's just like, okay, this is the part that's going to make or break this lesson. And if not, they have to go all the way back through those classes. So this is important that you kind of just give them the space that they need in order to, you know, get through this, okay? So pray for your masculine. I always say that, but, you know, your masculine needs to be praying for you too. I'm sure that they know that you're just being protected from all of this drama that they're dealing with. And so that makes them sad too because they want to come forward, but they can't because they're being blocked because father is like, nope. You got to finish learning this. You have to. So y'all can be equally yoked. You have to. So that's what your masculine is learning. Anyways, that's what I have for you guys. Let's go into divine masculine uh, silence. Because for some reason, I'm getting that, you know, it's some things that they probably want to say to this karmic today. And it's some things that they want to tell you today. I'm getting that typing and deleting. And that's crazy because I said that. And then the communication card comes out. So let's get a few messages on that. So that's going to be next. Thank you so much for your time. 555 on a timer as I say that. Transformation's happening, okay? You just got to walk with life on this one. You just got to let life be <laughs> at this point, okay? That's what I have for you, Divine Feminine. Thank you so much for your time. Next video for the next message. Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine. Okay, this is Divine Masculine Silence. I always say Divine Masculine, but y'all know how this goes. Sometimes, you know, it is the whoever's the runner. So it could be Divine Feminine who got you blocked or ghosted or something like that. Whatever the case may be. This is what they want to say today, especially with it being a holiday, okay? So let's see what Divine Masculine would like to tell this karmic, all right? Because that's the majority energy. Take it how it resonates. Flip it how it needs to be, okay? To match your situation. Um, We got, I don't want this anymore. Ooh, coming in hot. Divine Masculine does not want to be with this karmic anymore. That is very, very clear. It's been clear since the channel messages, y'all. I can't make any of these up. I just used the cards to confirm that this person does not want to be with this person anymore. They don't want to be with this karmic anymore. What else, Father? We have no future. Dang, this is coming in hot, y'all. This person is being very, very blunt. They're really being blunt. But like I said, the only reason why this person is still with this karmic is because of financial ties. I cannot make that part up. There's something about their finances that's making it hard for this masculine to leave. One more card to this karmic. And we're going to move on to the next. Uh, it says, I don't want to hurt you, but I don't want to lie anymore. And that means telling the truth. This whole, it's only been three cards I pulled. And these three cards are blunt truths. Okay? Very honest. Straight to the point. No sugar coated. Okay? Bottom of the deck energy here says, I can't be around you right now. So they don't even want to be in their vicinity. They don't want to be around them. I'm just hearing somebody's just not happy. They're just really, really just not happy, okay? So this is this masculine telling this karmic, I'm not happy. I don't want this anymore. We don't have a future. Well, what are we doing, okay? Let's see what the masculine wants to tell uh, divine feminine. So whatever they want to tell their counterpart, whoever this person is that's, you know, silent, that's got you blocked, that's not really talking or communicating, let's see what they want to say to you. First thing that says, I am thinking of the children. Didn't I say that? Because that's exactly what this holiday is about, okay? But it's all about childlike innocence as well. So you got to think about your inner, inner child as well, okay? Because sometimes people sacrifice without understanding you can't sacrifice everything. You can't pour from an empty cup. If you pour everything that you got into somebody else or something else that's just, it has no future, 
then you're just sitting there wasting and exhausting energy. Energy's not created nor destroyed, but it is transferred. So when you transfer all your energy to somebody else or something else and all of this drama, then you're not really at your best. And that, it, that, that means even in front of the kids. So this is why this person is still there because they're still trying to show up for these children, okay? Let's see, what else do they wanna say? What else, Barbie, do they wanna say? It says, you mean more to me than anyone ever has and I'm learning what that means. That's what your person feels like towards you. You mean more than anybody. And I'm learning, I keep telling y'all, it's all about this person learning some lessons. Ooh, and that flipped over real quick, two of them. I'm frustrated about what I have not yet achieved. So this person knows that they would not be in this situation if they had the financial opportunity to do so. Again, going back to the kids, going back to the fact that, you know, they're being emotionally and financially manipulated through this situation because they're not where they want to be. They don't have the stability that they want to have for their kids. And even right now, I'm hearing that this current situation was probably stable at some point. But it was still one-sided, it was still locked. It still didn't make sense, you know? And they tried to make it make sense and it's still not making sense. It says, you may not like the real me though. That's what your masculine wants to tell you. You might not like the real me, okay? And give me one more card to wrap this up and we'll go to the last video for today. Oh, two cards came. It says, give me time, I will contact you. So your person does wanna reach out to you. They do wanna talk to you, okay? And then it says, I need you to forgive me because this is a lot. Y'all, this is a lot, okay? Especially when we're talking holidays. I'm hearing miss birthdays. I'm hearing miss, like, real significant stuff here, okay? So your person realizes that and they need you to forgive them on that. And I know it's hard. Don't harden your heart today. Whoever's watching or listening to me, do not harden your heart today. Just understand that things have to happen. You got to just... You know, trust. You gotta trust the universe. You gotta trust God. You gotta trust the angels that they know what they're doing. They're making this person learn a very harsh lesson. Bottom of the deck is I am processing my feelings. So they are. That's the reason why they still haven't reached out to you, okay? Because they're still trying to figure out what all of this even means, all right? And this is the hardest part of the test, especially to be away from you on such a holiday. But that's what I have for you guys, okay? Let's go to the last video for today so we can get the last, um, you know, to wrap all of this up for today. Thank you so much for your time as usual, okay? Last video for the last message. Thank you. Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine, okay? This is the last of your Christmas reading. We're going to wrap this up with some love messages, some heart cards, okay? This is how I want to wrap this up, okay? So we're just going to see what's going on with Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine in your love life today. What's going on, Father? What is going on? Let's do Divine Masculine first. Divine Masculine, we got secret admirers. Someone has deeper feelings than they are letting on. I'm hearing that this is you. You're kind of keeping it cool. You're not really showing your cards. You're not showing your hand right now. Especially today, you really want to reach out. You really want to say some things, okay? And I'm hearing some loving things. Some things that, you know, um, that you haven't said to your person in a very long time. You admire them so much. You really do want to be in their presence, okay? Give me one more card for Divine Masculine for today, Father. Give me one more card. Oh, and it says sexual union. Honor the place in one another where you're one internal soul. For there you will find true bliss. So you are thinking about them that way too. <laughs> sexual union and secret admirer, okay? This is a very big sex sacred contract is what i'm hearing sacred contract so it's not like you just want to smash you just want a one night stand or you just want to see how it feels like again no you really want to be committed to this person forever divine feminine let's see what's going on with you today divine feminine wait don't rush into it allow nature to take its course you got wait twice today i mean you know you just gotta know that father knows what he's saying he just reiterated this to you you got to let the nature take its course when it comes down to your, your connection because he does have this, okay? He's got this. He's wrapping this up. He's letting these people learn the lessons that they need to learn. And again, don't forget that you're being protected from a lot of things. So you got to just let things happen, okay? Divine Feminine, we also got it's important right now to take a step back and spend some time alone. Instead of placing your focus on another, now is the time to forgive yourself. To give to yourself, I'm sorry. So give to yourself. Remember I talked about that empty cup. You need to be giving to you right now. 
And that's so hard to hear, especially on a day where it's just like, you know, you want to be in your vicinity with your family. I'm hearing family. You consider this person a family member, like, for real. Let's get one for both to wrap this whole thing up. We got two. You may not under always understand why certain things happen. However, there's always a higher purpose to the events in your life. Through turmoil, a blessing will soon be revealed. So remember, I talked about that forgiveness as well. You got to forgive yourself. You got to forgive others. And understand that you might not always understand. The answers are not just always there. But you know because you just have this inner knowing, okay? You just got to trust that part. And then it says, look inside yourself. Examine what's causing you to feel this way. It's the waiting. I know it is, y'all. For both of y'all, it's the waiting. <laughs> You know, because he got to finish his test and you got to finish up your stuff and she got to finish up this. It's a lot of waiting here, okay? But it's worth it, okay? Look inside yourself and see why it's making you feel this way. So wait, because you got to wait for the... Think about some of the best things in your life and how long it took for that to happen. Even if it's we're talking about going through school, even if we're talking about getting a license, getting any kind of thing, you know, you needed to wait. And so that's what's happening right now, okay? That's what I have for you guys. I hope this is from... Oh, bottom of the deck here is new beginning. It says a new adventure. Oh, wait. Embrace it and leave, live your dreams passionately. So there is a new beginning on the horizon, all right? And that's so crazy because that comes with that same little bird as this card, okay? So yeah, y'all will be okay. Just try to make the best out of today. Enjoy today as much as you can. Love on yourself, you know, like I said, and if you can't really just shake that energy, get you some rest. It's okay to say, I don't wanna be bothered right now, y'all, let me go lay down. And that helps. It really does. Okay? That's what I have for you all today. I hope this information helped and blessed as usual. Y'all, happy holidays. Again, my condolences and my prayers and all of my love goes out to y'all because, you know, it, holidays are hard. I am just going to keep saying that because it is. If you're dealing with a love life that's not where you want it to be, if you're dealing with family members, if you're dealing with loss of love or loss of a loved one, whatever the case may be, just try to enjoy the best out of today, okay, you guys? Um, and if you can't, like I said, get you some rest, okay? That's what I have for you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. No Zodiac signs today either. Just enjoy your family or enjoy yourself, you know, love on yourself. And, um, you know, the full video will be available on YouTube. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget that I am selling my Twin Flame Oracle deck, you guys. It's on the TikTok shop and also on my website. And last but not least, you guys, don't forget to like the notifications. Go to the page, hit the notifications so you know when I go live again, okay? So y'all can see, y'all can get some personal private messages if you want. Or if you cannot wait until I go live again, you can always book me, justdreamguide.com. It's on every video. Can't miss it. Thank y'all for y'all time. Thank you for the love that y'all sent. I hope y'all have a very blessed, happy holiday, okay? See y'all next time.